So it is that time of the year again, folks. The Love Evolved update is active, and that means that there are special fish that we need to be catching. We need to catch some love this year. Uh, so they obviously updated this event last year, which basically kind of brought it up to speed with some other recent events. Um, I think previously it was literally just like extra breeding rates, and then also you could get these boxes of chocolates, which, by the way, OP. I want to get tons of those, although I'm thinking that they're probably going to maybe go away after the update is like no longer active. So I think for the next week, we might have access to these boxes of chocolates, which is a very OP item. You can use it on a tame. You can like feed it to a tame and it's going to half tame them. So use it on something big like a Gigo or a Mosa or just something maybe like a Quetzal. Something that takes a lot of kibble, just pop one of those in and bam, you're going to have it half tamed already. Uh, there is a cooldown though, so you can't really use uh, a couple of them on the same creature. Anyway, um, so yeah, we have uh, a couple new skins here today. We have the heart-shaped skin right here for a shield, and then we also have these sunglasses, which I'm kind of curious about because we had a cool animation in the summer update um, on the sunglasses. So I don't know if it's going to have a different one or that same one. I, I think that could be cool. But anyway, yeah, we also have a couple other little like skins and stuff here. I might try and get the full costume. I think I already have one piece from one of the previous events. I can't remember which one that is. I'm not sure if I kept that though. Um, and then also we have the bow and arrows. I can't use that because I have a stack mod. It just doesn't work with the arrows. So we can't really check that out. Um, don't really have much use for the handcuffs. But the grenade is what I'm curious about because now we have a tropio. I'm curious if I pop that skin onto a stack of grenades. Does it make a different explosion? I kind of want to know. So uh, we're going to check out a bunch of this new stuff and uh, hopefully try to not get too bored while fishing today because that's literally the bulk of this video. We're going to have to fish. Uh, it's just something they have to do. And I have me some honey right here, which is the best thing to use while fishing. And I've also done some preparing. Uh, where is it? Did I? I think it's still out. I didn't. Maybe I didn't put it away. I think it might be up here. I tamed myself a Pelagornis recently because I knew that we would have to use this thing to get some fish here today. So yeah, I'm all prepared and all ready to do this. So let me check this little pond down here. Last year, I think I did this on Ragnarok. Um, I'm not sure where the best spot for fish is here on Val, but we're going to see if we can find a couple good spots. Uh, I think I actually see some. Yeah. Yeah. Look at you right there. Hang on. Let me land right here. That's one of the special fish right there. So you want to go for the ones with hearts, like kind of like going around their face and stuff like that. I thought I saw another one, but I think that's just a regular fish. So let me go ahead and just eat that one. It's probably best that we just dispatch of the ones that we don't want to catch because obviously if we catch them, it's just going to be like a waste of time. I want to be going for some of the new ones, the little heart ones. So let me see. Uh, I think it's just the little coal dudes or whatever way you pronounce that. I don't really care. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's just those ones that can give you the stuff. So just dispatch of all salmon and everything else that is in the area. And honestly, a Pelagornis is definitely a really good creature to be using for this type of thing. It just absolutely obliterates them, even though they're so far down. All right, any more fish up here? We see a couple of them here, but I don't know if there's any heart ones. Oh, we got a heart one over there. My Pelagornis is struggling to stay in the water, though. Oh, my God. <gasps> what the hell? That's like a tiny little one. Wow. I barely even spotted that dude. Hang on. Wait, we got to kill. The Ooh, I almost killed that one. Um, I don't know. Maybe I did. I'm not sure. Uh, let's see if we can just get rid of all these dudes. So we have two of them down this way. Let's start over here then. Do we have any more fish? Because obviously I just want these dudes. Okay, I think we're good to go then. So uh, if you want to be fishing, you have to be on either the back of a Pelagornis or sitting on a chair or a bench or something like that. Obviously, you can pop those onto a raft, which is nice. But uh, Pelagornis is definitely the better creature to do this with. So pretty much just toss it out. Uh, I don't know if actually popping it near the creature would really make much of a difference. But I'm just going to do this. Boom. And uh, once it starts uh, like trying to catch or... Oh, wait. No, look. There's another fish over there. I didn't even see him. So once this fish tries to go for the bait, we're going to have to go into like a little mini game. I'm just explaining this because I know some people probably have never fished at all and you're really confused on how to do this. So we're going to wait for the mini game. Oh my god, I, I wasn't even watching. There we go. All right, so we got the mini game going. So you pretty much just have to lure it in by hitting all of the buttons whenever it asks. Um, and then on a keyboard, it's pretty much like the nine. Oh, there we go. It's pretty much like the nine buttons around WASD. 
So, yeah. <laughs> Let's see. What do we get? So, we got four candies. Uh, and then I think we got a chibi. Yeah, we got an ammonite chibi. I think that's all, right? Pretty sure. Okay, not bad. I'm actually... I'm gonna need these candies, obviously, because they're, they're basically part of the little crafting recipes. So, that just took a long-ass time to actually get that thing. Like two or, or three minutes of just sitting there and then finally it decided to go ahead and eat it so yeah that's cool <laughs> just oh i just i lack the patience for this type of thing i don't know i really i just don't like it let's see let's see if we can get this other one this tidy little one so uh i think obviously the bigger the fish it is uh the better the loot you're gonna get but um i might not actually be with these valentine's fish are you kidding me this is supposed to be a, a a happy positive event filled with love and, and kindness and you just killed yourself to not be with me that's awful <laughs> all right cool that's great so uh not a good example uh fish like that just don't deserve any time let's see um <laughs> i can't believe it just killed itself <laughs> all right great uh let's see okay well we got we got one right there let's try and go for that one uh we've got a bunch of dead fish here because i killed a bunch of them and didn't eat them fully apparently that's cool. So we got that one. I think we have a couple more. Oh my god, there's tons of salmon now. Um, yeah, we gotta kill some more of these dudes. Like, I, I don't want to actually catch any of these guys. I want to only try and go for the heart ones. So, yeah, we gotta just dispatch up all these dudes again. Oh, my mouse flew off the screen. That's cool. I don't know what's happening. Uh, weird. All right, well, we have a T-Rex over there. I might have to kill that thing first. We have a couple of fish in here. That we can maybe catch. Oh, oh, I didn't even see that one there. It was a tiny little one. All right, so we have a couple. I just, I'm trying to get rid of the rest of them here. That's the main issue. It's kind of hard to see as well. All right, there's another one that I need to take care of. I wish I had a tech helmet right now. That would be great. That way I could just see the outlines and everything. All right, got that one. I think we should be good to go. I, I, mean, I might need to take out that T-Rex though. I feel like we probably should. It would be the smarter option. We also need to kill that fish right there. Um, alrighty, let's see. Let's go ahead and take out this, this little T-Rex. I don't know what level it is. Don't really care. Let's just shoot at it and kill it. There we go. We're good. Only a level 30. Alright, so we had this fish here. We have to kill that one. Okay, so we have like two fish that we can catch in the area. Where's that other one? There it is. Boom. All right, we're kind of like getting weird lag spikes because I'm like loading and deloading my base because it's like right over there. Uh, all right, let's see. See if we can manage to get more fish. I don't know what the hell's happening right now. <laughs> what was that? That was weird. Oh my God. Oh, there we go. I don't know if this is a Valentine's fish though. I don't think it is. I'm not exactly sure. <laughs> e, D, E. Z, Z, Z. Yeah, that was one. Okay, cool. Oh, sweet. This is actually one of the new chibis right here, the Mesopithecus. And we got a box of chocolates. All right. So, oh, one more thing, actually. Uh, I forgot. This thing can also fully heal a creature. So, very useful. A very useful uh, item. I completely forgot about that thing. Yeah. So... You know, you could you could have your Giga on death's door or just whatever creature and then just pop one of those and BAM! Straight away, it's fully healed. I don't know if it works on the Extinction Titans, though. I'm actually kind of curious about that. Let me know if it does. I don't even know, actually. I'm, I'm sure people have tried it, though. All right, let's even get this get this other one right here. Um, <laughs> come to me, fishy. Oh, my God, there's more of them over there now. They weren't there a minute ago. Okay, I'm pretty sure we're catching, yeah... This isn't going to be a Valentine's fish, but that's okay. I mean, we can catch it anyway. There we go. All right, a bunch of random things. Cool. Great. Uh, let's see. There it is. It just moved super far away from me. Please don't jump out of the water, though. Please stay alive for me. I just want to love you. Ah, God damn it. Another one that is not going to give me what I need. Oh, my God. Don't do it. I swear. Please stay in the water. Hey, there we go. More chocolates. And we also got Carcanos. Nice. Oh, wow. Okay. Does that increase when it... Okay, it does increase when you put them into here. So, yeah. Go ahead and put your boxes of chocolates into your creature. Wait. Where did my candies go? Oh, there they are. Okay. I didn't... I just... I have too many things in my inventory now because of all the random items I'm getting. 
All right, cool. So we're all good. Oh, I never even checked out this uh, Mesopithecus, actually. Let's pop that on real quick. Will I be able to see that? It's super dark right now. Uh, maybe we'll just wait till later. It does look kind of interesting, though. Cool. All righty. So we've got more fish back here. I actually, I they just keep spawning. Um, there's probably a bunch of fish that I need to kill now. Yeah, more of them just keep spawning. I don't know. I feel like they up, they turn up like the rates of fish spawning for this event or something like that. Because like their, their respawn rate is way too quick considering how close I am. So yeah, you can see we've got a bunch of the heart ones in there anyway. They're really easy to spot at nighttime. So I think maybe I'll just come over here because there's like a bunch of them in the same area. Um, all right, let's just chuck it out there. So yeah, uh, in terms of the new chibis, what's on the list? We have, I know there's an otter chibi, mesopithecus, uh, what else is there? Okay, yeah, so the other ones are crystal wyvern, um, enforcer, and velonosaur. So I'm actually, I'm pretty interested in trying to get a crystal wyvern one. I think that would actually look really nice. Um, they don't specify which, but I imagine that it's just gonna look like a fire wyvern. All those ones kind of look like fire wyverns, don't they? I think they do. It's been a little while. Um, but yeah, all right, cool. I like that. Enforcer sounds interesting as well, uh, considering it's like a robot. <laughs> so yeah, that's cool. I think, uh, I thought we were about to get a bite right there. Damn it. Okay, never mind. Oh my god, we got so many of them around. Although now we have more fish, and I have one right over there. Please don't bite. I don't want you. I want that one. <laughs> oh my god. Let me have that one. Come on, come take the bait. Oh, man. I don't know if having a better fishing rod actually helps with the fish. I don't know if it makes them latch better or something like that. But uh, I know that uh, you can get better loot and stuff by having a better one. I I'm kind of curious. Like, would it be worth trying to kill an Alpha Mosa or a Tuso, I think, is the other creature that gives it? There we go. Nice. Um, but, yeah, those creatures can actually give you a, a pretty good one. Yeah, let's see. Okay, so we got a Dire Bear. Interesting. Uh, where's that other fish? Let me kill this one. Look, like, tons of them are just spawning. That's great, but, like, I need the I need the heart fish, not regular ones. Thank you very much. All right, let's see. So we got a couple of them around. Oh, man. <laughs> this is, like, the worst event. I, I don't even know how this would actually work on official. Like, do you guys have to set up turrets around the, the little ponds you guys want to do this in? Like, because it's definitely worth doing this to get those heart those little boxes of chocolates those things they're great like you need those like they're really good so um yeah <laughs> i don't know how this would actually work on official i feel like that fish right there is probably gonna nibble there we go got it all right i'm i'm done oh my god i don't even know how long we've we been doing this for i got like two hours of footage <laughs> oh my god I hate this. Like, it's the worst. I hate fishing in Ark, especially with, you know, with the crappy fishing rod. I don't know if it makes a difference having a better one, but yeah, I broke four of them. Where do they even go? Oh, I guess when they break, they just full on break. Interesting. Well, uh, yeah, we've got, how many is that? Nine chocolate, chocolate boxes. I can't even speak at this stage. Um, nine of them. That's cool. Yeah, we've been doing this for over two hours because that one right there has it's down by like two hours on this thing anyway so yeah we've got tons of candy we've got a good amount of chocolate not as much as i would want but we can get that by breeding it's probably easier on my server to just go ahead and mass breed and just try to get them that way i know you have a small percentage chance of actually getting those so yeah um in terms of chibis i think i only got one that is like a new one right i didn't get an otter i didn't get oh i did get a feather light which isn't new but it's kind of somewhat new I think it was for the Christmas event is when we had this one come out or whatever. Um, we did get two Mesopithecus. Where even is that one? There it is. There's one of them. Let's see. That is the one that we had equipped. That's actually kind of a nice color. I like that. And then we've got the other one right here. Boom. And that is also kind of an interesting color. It looks like a really derpy chibi, to be honest. Oh, my God. Look at that little face. Oh, man. All right. Well, uh, yeah, I think what we're going to do now is uh, maybe try to actually make up some of these things. So we need... Do I even have any raw metal? I probably don't. All right. Here you go. Boom. We apparently already had some wood. Um, we also had spark powder from the fishing. Cool. All right. Let's see. Can we make the shield? Boom. There we go. Let's get one of those. Let's get the glasses as well. 
Um, boom. I'm not going to make any chibis this way because it seems like a waste. I feel like maybe we'll just recycle some of our chibis inside of the, um, the whatever it's called. I can't even think. It's, I'm just so tired. <laughs> I did, I wasn't paying like full on attention when I was doing the, um, the fishing. Like I had to like look back every few seconds just to see if we had anything. Let's see. Did, is there like any sort of like cool animation for that or anything? Oh yeah. Okay. So I figured that it would be the exact same as the summer one. Yeah. That's yeah. I like that. Let me go ahead and paint those. Do I, I think, yeah, I did. Okay. There it is. Let's see. Um, so you can paint them cyan. Don't know what this would be painting. Let's just paint that cyan and leave the center as like, uh, the pink <laughs> or I guess that's kind of like purpley pink. Uh, I like that. That's cool. I like it. All right. Um, what else do we have? We have the shield skin. Uh, oh, I did take that out. I didn't think I did for there, there for a second. I can't even, I can't even word right now. So tired. Um, all right, let's see. What is this like? Huh? It looked a lot bigger in the images that they showed off, but, uh, yeah. So that is the heart shield. Interesting. Let's see. Where can we paint that as well? Um, I assume like the center and then the edge. Okay. So that's the little kind of lines and the edge. What is that? That is the straps at the back. And there we go. That is the center bit. What region's this though? The little padding and then I don't know what that is. I think, oh, okay. So there's like two bits of uh, detail here. So let's do that one and that one. Boom. All right, cool. Yeah, not, not as nice as some other uh, little cosmetic things, but yeah, okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, all right, let's go ahead and just make those grenades as well or not grenades. It's just one little skin. I don't have any wool. Oh my god uh, All right, we got to go shave a sheep and get some water. Let me sort this out All right, we're just waiting for the base to load back in so I can run in <laughs> All right, let's see so I got the wool and Let us make this thing um, Where is the wool boom? Okay so I just want one of those. Nice. We're not going to bother with any of these things because for the moment, I don't really feel like we need those or want those. Um, I do have a big stack of grenades here. Now, this is because uh, I recently enough, I kind of just was fed up of like constantly having to craft more and more ammo. So I went ahead and just crafted tons of like the ammos that I use all the time, like freaking shotgun ammo and uh arrows and long neck bullets and stuff like that so yeah that's why we have a stack of 500 grenades because i also had a lot of uh <laughs> i had a lot of the stuff left over um what do you call gunpowder there we go so let's see trop there we go you are my ascended tropio all right let's see let me see if this makes a difference which i don't think it will but it might so we gotta oh crap i don't have any um Hang on, we gotta get some gas for this thing. Unless I have some, oh, I do have some in here. Sweet, okay. All right, so I wonder if this actually makes a difference. Boom. Oh, that's disappointing. That definitely doesn't make a difference. Damn it, oh, that would have been so cool. That's such a good opportunity for them to do something creative there. Damn. Yeah, that would have been nice. I definitely would have appreciated that. So let's just pull one out of there. Uh, well, now we can have infinite teddy bear bombs because we can just go ahead and, and uh, refill the stack whenever we want to or just split that up or whatever. So let's test this thing out. It's been a while since I've seen this. So boom. And then let's see. Boom. Yeah. Nice. It just kind of has like little particles after. It has some nice little colors and stuff. Let's actually chuck one into the air and see what it looks like. I'm just going to cook it and now. Oh, wow. Okay. I thought that would blow up sooner. Okay. Well, that is awesome. I uh, really would have appreciated that on the Tropio. That would have been really cool. But uh, yeah. Anyway, at least you're actually able to use them when you put that skin onto them. I was kind of worrying that you might not be able to, but you are. So that's good. Um, I'm just going to leave you there for the moment. I'll clean that up later. So, yeah, um, I guess one more thing we could do is maybe just recycle some of these chibis and see if we can get anything useful. So let's go ahead and do that then. I got a lot of Karkonos ones for some reason. 
Oh, we got a theory there. Boom. Boom. I think I already had a theory before. Bulb dog. I feel like I have a bulb dog one. I think we do. So I'm not going to keep that one. Pretty sure we do. Okay, so we didn't really get anything good out of that. I do have a bunch of chibis in bulk over here. Pretty sure that I have, like, most of these already. See, I've got my, like, full collection down here. Um, to be honest, they really need to add some sort of display case or something. I don't, I don't know. Like, they just keep adding more chibis. And at this stage, it's kind of becoming pointless. Like, what, what's the point of having all of these chibis, you know? Like... You can only level one chibi. Where the hell is... Okay, there it is. Okay. So I want to keep the other one. I, I think I like that one more. So yeah, I already actually did have that bulb dog one. So yeah, um, I don't know. This is like my collection. Some of them are doubled for some reason. I have a couple of broodmother ones. But yeah, uh, for the majority of them there, they uh, I just have like one of each. So I think I might try to see if we can chance our, our arm here and uh, try to get some more chibis that I don't already have by just recycling these ones. Seriously feel like they definitely need to add something though. Like some sort of like reason to collect more than, than, you know, one chibi. <laughs> it's, it's really pointless at this stage. Like they just keep adding more. I don't even know how many there is now. There's definitely gotta be more than a hundred at this stage. Okay, so I recycled all those chibis and I didn't get anything new. Uh, why do we have a bunch of these now? What the hell? Is that because I used the grenade? Does it give you the skin back? Hang on a second. Really? Does it actually do that? I think it might. Is this a way of getting like a bunch of these skins? That's That's got to be some sort of bug. That can't be right. Hang on. Let's see. And uh, now. Yeah, look at that. I just got a skin. Huh. Didn't know that that was possible. Okay, uh, interesting. Yeah, not really sure if that's supposed to be like that. I imagine it's probably not because that seems a little silly. Uh, you know what, actually? You know what? Let me just craft one chibi. If we have enough stuff, I'll craft one chibi. Uh, maybe let's, let's just put the spark powder in here. I didn't want to just light it with one piece of, of wood in there. Uh, let's just try to craft one of these. Boom. If we get something good, that's awesome. If not, then whatever. We got a day on. Okay, never mind. All right. Well, you know what? It's probably a short ass video, but I just kind of wanted to check out this new little event. It's not a super amazing, gigantic event or anything like that, but we have at least checked out the majority of the things in it. Hope you guys enjoy the fishing. I certainly don't. <laughs> I feel like I'm complaining a lot more. Oh, <gasps> I don't think I had that one. Nice. Okay, sweet. I feel like I'm complaining a lot more than I should be about the fishing, but I just don't enjoy it. I really don't. Did I already have a shine horn? I feel like I might have actually. Let me go check my collection. I, I just, again, there's so many of them. I don't even know which ones I have half the time. Uh, did I have a shine horn though? Um, shine horn would probably be around here somewhere, right? It would be, I don't think I did a shine. See, nope, no shine horn. All right, sweet. So that's a new one for me. Awesome. Um, but yeah, so far in here, I have 72 and a couple double ups of brood mothers. But yeah, basically like 70 different chibis in here, provided that I haven't doubled up on anything else. Um, yeah, cool. Well, we're going to try and obviously collect some of the newer ones. I really want to check out that enforcer one. But uh, yeah, I'll see if I can manage to get it at some stage. I might try and do some more of this fishing. But I'm really, I'm really edging to maybe kill an alpha mosa to try and get a good fishing rod and see if that's any better. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think and let me know what you guys uh, have learned from this event. Because I actually can't remember last year if I needed to use a better one or just a primitive. Can't remember at all. But anyway, yeah, that is it for today. If you guys have enjoyed the video, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button. Really would appreciate it. And uh, yeah, enjoy the fishing. Because seriously, it's, it's super boring. <sighs> Man. <laughs>